Molly Shannon is comedy <laughs> royalty, entertaining us for decades. And guys, the hits just keep coming. Her HBO Max sitcom, The Other Two, is back for its third season. People love it. But first, we have lots to catch up with Molly on. Hi, hi Molly. Hi, Hoda. Hi, Jenna. Oh, my gosh. We love you. We oh love you. Gosh. And we love that you hosted SNL. Oh, it was How was that, going back to that stage? I have to tell you, Hoda and Jenna, I was so nervous. Are you? It's kind of like a <gasps> muscle that you haven't worked out for a while. But the second you do it, it all Look comes you. back you to look. you. And, oh. and were your kids in the audience watching? Yes, my your kids teenagers? were. My, Stella and my daughter and Nolan, my son, were and my husband were all in the audience. And it, my my kids had come to the show for the 40th, but they were so little then. Yeah. Gosh, so this was. Oh, oh, that's they're Nolan adults. and that's Stella. Yeah, so there. It was just so special having them there to to see the show because they don't remember when they were little when they came. So. Just to, for them to experience. Do they that. think it you was, were funny? Do they? They did. They, they, did. they liked it. But I was going to say, just to have outlived my mom, who died when yeah. I was four, and to then experience that with my kids, Oof. it was so deeply special to me. That was oh. the, the, my favorite part of the whole thing. I oh. was talking um, to Hoda this morning about your beautiful mm -hmm. memoir mm -hmm. because I feel like you are this light mm -hmm. and oh full God. of humor, but mm -hmm. you did live, um, you know, some so heart aching. Mm -hmm painful moments. Mm -hmm. yes, yes. What did you learn from both of your parents mm -hmm. that helped you, um, you. mother your kids? Because I know being a mother mm -hmm. is your most important job. Oh, what did I learn? Well, I would say my dad always had like a zest for life. Like he was always like, likes to have fun yeah. and make games out of things. So that kind of joie de vivre. Mm -hmm. And and um, he just, he was silly. Yeah. And he wasn't strict about school. So I recommend that. He was mm. very like, oh, don't worry and don't get stressed out. He didn't yeah, he didn't well, like especially that. now when kids are so yes. worried it's about everything. everything. Yeah, and it's gotten so much harder with the international competition. But um, and then my mom, when I was really little, before she died, I distinctly remember I was worried about making friends. This was when I was four, and I saw a girl on her bike, and I was like, I wonder if I'm gonna have friends. And she was like, I think you're gonna have a lot of friends. Oh. And she taught me how to go up to a little girl, introduce okay. myself, and <sighs> so both of them. Who, gave, who taught you how to be a mom? Because it, it, yeah. it wasn't mom. So interesting. Yeah. Interesting, Hoda. Right. It wasn't, it's so strange. Like, yeah, now being the mom of teenagers, I'm like, I have no, yeah. you know, point. reference yeah. point. Um, so that's such a good question. But I, I yeah, I, I didn't learn that because yeah. my mom, I was so little when she died. But um, I just try to do a really good job and I, I read a lot of books, like parenting Probably, books. Yeah. And, I feel yeah. like it's instinctive. I, You're such a good human being. It really, it really must translate. And you've got... Thank you. And one thing I was going to yeah. say was I was saying I try not to believe the stuff about teenagers. Yes. Like people, oh, it's so hard. I really think that if you go into that thinking that, that you could almost perpetuate that because that has not been my experience at all. I love being the mother to teens. And I was saying, too, that I always ask my kids, do you have any notes about me or how I could be a better parent? And if they do give me a note, I'm like, okay, I'll work on that. And that, you know I what feel like that's that good. That also says yes. about you is that you're totally confident yeah. in yourself. Like, you're yeah. hearing one thing, like, yes. it'd be better if you did this, does not yeah. break you. You're right. Exactly. You grown. And you learn so much about yourself, yeah. you know, mm -hmm. so it's good. Um, okay, I also want to copy you because I heard you <laughs> once dressed up... Um, as a babysitter oh and trying to prank gosh. your children. You so yes, crazy. we did. We tricked my son and his friend, my son Nolan and his friend, I think, Walker. And uh -huh. we, my daughter and I pretended that there was a new babysitter coming to meet for a job interview, like a weird babysitter nanny. So my daughter Stella dressed me up in like a wig and these weird glasses. And I, and I appeared outside while they were up in the window and I waved with like a leaf. And Nolan and Walker were looking outside and they were like, she looks so weird. And they didn't know it was me. So we used to do stuff oh like that. Oh my God, I'm we dying. Were, okay, wait, we, we have digging. to fact check some things. Well, yeah, we were digging into your history and your oh past. My, okay. I think this was on Wikipedia, so it's worth checking out. You were a what well, a food food demo demo girl, girl according to at, wiki yes it was so fun i worked at marina del rey and gelson's and i passed out samples of huxtable's liver pate and oh. it was so fun wow i, like, I don't know <laughs> that that would be my first choice what about a <laughs> cheese pate. cube you know what i mean <laughs> yeah exactly you prefer a cheese cube but it, it's really fun giving people free food because they come up and talk to you and you learn a lot about list, people yeah. list your jobs that you had so you did that i did that i worked at um uh cravings restaurant on Sunset Boulevard as a hostess and I got so known for being a hostess that um, they had a really good 
grilled lemon chicken salad. So whenever people would see me outside of there, they would recognize me from the restaurant and they would go, grilled lemon chicken salad. <laughs> and then I was like, like that's not I didn't want to be Wait, known we don't for that. Have that much time, but we have to hear yes. about your wardrobe malfunction. Oh my gosh. Please. So this is the craziest story, Jenna and Hoda. When I, I got nominated for an Emmy early on, I think when I was on Saturday Night Live, and, and it was when I was kind of new to showbiz, and um, um, my wonderful publicist, um, Melissa Cates, um, I think, or maybe it was before I had Melissa, I'm not sure, okay. but, but anyhow, I got hooked up with a designer who was like a new designer, and I don't think the dress was perfectly <laughs> fitted, because she was newer, and, <laughs> and I went on the red carpet, and I was so excited, my moment of glory, and I waved to all the fans, <laughs> and it was like a halter, and it was, fell down. Oh, I was completely no. topless, Wait, ladies, what? and I didn't realize it, and I was waving, topless, <laughs> hello, Hollywood. <laughs> Molly Shannon and my pup. Yeah, it was Melissa. I had to come and lift the dress up. Oh, you, did you die? And then I saw Julia Roberts oh, a geez. few weeks later at like some event, and she oh, was like, "Girl, the dress? yeah, that is the dress. I oh, think it was that. Yeah, one moment later, that. Oh, there oh, it goes. Yes. Wait. And Thankfully, nobody has Julia yet. Roberts saw me at this thing, and she was like, girl, I saw you. You rallied. And I was like, oh, my God. This is rough. Can you imagine? But it was for, before the Internet. Yeah, thank God. Thank God. God. Uh, so much happened. But can oh. you imagine that I didn't know that it was, it was down? down. It was down. I was oh like, hey, Hollywood. <laughs> no. All right, wait, Molly, don't go anywhere. You're going to be joined by your co-star, Helena yes. York, from The Other Two, coming up right after this. Oh, my God. So okay, that is funny. Funny. We are back with Molly Shannon and Helena York, who star in the HBO Max sitcom that everybody's buzzing about, The Other Two. Yeah, Molly <laughs> plays Pat, a former talk show host turned network owner, and Helena plays her daughter, Brooke, who is a talent manager. You guys, this show is like lightning yes. in a bottle. People <laughs> love it. Yes. Well. Helena, what, what, what was it about this character that you were like, okay... Yeah. I'm, I'm in. I think we're all kind of a disaster, and <laughs> she does that for us. Um, I think that, you know, being a person that sort of dives head first into an empty pool, um, maybe doesn't think necessarily before she speaks, it's a character that I think people are into. And I think people like the show because the... It's a it's a family that really loves each other as opposed to like at each other's throats in the end of time. Could you believe that story that yeah. Molly just told before the commercial break? Uh, no. Have you ever heard I that? I couldn't believe I hadn't heard it. I was like, I just love like Hollywood. <laughs> <laughs> I love that too. So you were shooting this with a baby, three month old, a three month old. Yeah, yes. I found an apartment for my mom like a couple blocks away, and she lived here and looked after him while we shot the third season. Um, and oh, it was just look great. at the look at that oh, baby! Oh. Don't you just want to eat him? Yes, I do. Get out oh. the knives and forks, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> and salt and pepper. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Y'all are, are crazy. But also, I heard that you you really looked up to Molly. Yeah. I mean, we've been oh. talking to Molly about her mothering and her advice yeah. all morning. So yeah. Well, Molly's always given amazing advice, like, has always, and will, like, listen to all your little nuances, like, who you're dating and, like, what's going on and, like, really get into it. And then, you know, when I had a kid, I got home from the hospital and there was this huge bag from, like, basket from Zabar's and I was like, who sent me 500 oh, bagels? Oh and it was Molly God. Shannon, like, knew exactly what I would have ne so needed in that moment. And I'm I was, like, hydrate. eating rugula and I was like, this is so hard. <laughs> I love that. Yeah. The chemistry between you guys is incredible. Have y'all wow. worked together? Is this the first time you guys This have is the first time we've worked together. What is it about her, Helena, that makes her so well, kind of Helena's magic? Helena's hilarious, yes, first of is. all. And she's just really open. Like I said, we formed a fast, easy friendship because we would talk about private stuff. And yeah. that, that really does help with the yeah. on-screen relationship yeah. when you naturally connect and right, talking about dating, now marriage, and, you know, and kids. motherhood and yes. kids, yes. and you have a fast, you know, and then, of course, yeah, so so you you can trans translate like, that to the performance, yeah. hopefully. And watching Molly and how much she prioritizes her family yes. and her two kids, it's it's like, you know, you can get so bogged down in, like, what this industry is and what we have to do and, like, ah, fight to get to the top. <laughs> and, um, you know, and I think that what's really important is what's at home, and she's always... You've been an amazing example to me. Aww. Thank you. That's God, so you guys, can sweet. Can we just say happy Mother's Day to y'all? Yeah. Oh, my to gosh. You. Thank you. I forgot. It's That's right. Mother's Day. Oh, my but you, what you said you know. about being a, a parent to teen yeah. moms was so beautiful, and yeah. I think we're going to take that. Yes. Mm -hmm. For yeah. anyone who missed it, it's like don't always think the worst years are the teen yeah. years because oh. then you're putting it out in the universe, Yeah, you're right? almost making that true. I feel yeah. that people that think that can almost perpetuate yeah. that myth or whatever. We're all learning. Yeah, no. You guys, this is awesome. Oh, my gosh. Please, stream 
season so three good. of the other two. It's on HBO Max.